From this day forward, I will love you to the best of my ability. Dear body, I owe you an apology. I've spent my whole life wishing I didn't have you. I've used food to stuff you until you were sick. I have underfed you. I made you wear sweatshirts and jeans in the hot summer to cover you up because I was so embarrassed of you and I didn't want anyone to see that I wasn't perfect and that my body wasn't perfect. I put you down for so long. I've said so many mean things to you. I've wished I could trade you in for a new body. I've used food to cope with not liking you and I've gained so much weight that I gave you health problems and stretched skin. Even when I decided to take care of you and lose weight to make you healthy, I still didn't like you. I was embarrassed of your loose skin and your belly fat and your stretch marks and your cellulite. I was still so mean to you and I put you down constantly. I'm so sorry. You stuck by me even though I've put you through so much. You bounced back so quickly when I lost weight. And when I made the decision to get healthy, to get you healthy, you allowed me to move my body again, enjoy my food so that I could take care of you. I want you to know I'm learning to love you and I'm doing everything I can to take care of you now. I want to show you how grateful I am to you for always sticking by me. From this day forward, I will love you to the best of my ability. I will feed you properly, I will say nice things to you, and I will take really good care of you. Thank you for always sticking by me, even when I haven't been very good to you. I've put you through so much trauma, and you've forgiven me no matter what. And I want to say thank you. Thank you for sticking by me no matter what and thank you for letting me love you properly now. I love you, love, Nicole. Okay, the friends, that was a really emotional letter that I wrote myself a couple of days ago because I have put myself, my body, through so much. And I know a lot of you out there that are watching this do the same thing every day. From the moment we wake up till the moment we go to bed, we are putting our bodies down, we're being mean to our bodies, we're overfeeding them, we're underfeeding them, we're stuffing them, we're saying mean things to them, we're staring at them in the mirror and putting them down constantly. We're ashamed of them, we're covering them up, we're embarrassed of them all day thoughts about our bodies about not liking it constantly fill our heads and I know what that's like I have struggled with my body and not liking it and not loving it and not treating it properly for years almost my entire life and I'm taking a stand today I'm finally ready to love my body no matter what it looks like. I'm ready to accept my loose skin from my weight loss. I'm ready to accept the stretch marks and the cellulite and the body fat I have and be okay with it and love my body. My body has done incredible things. It stretched so much when I was really heavy. And when I lost weight, it bounced back. Sure, it has some stretch marks and some wear and tear from being overweight, but our bodies are incredible things and we don't give them enough credit ever. And just let me know if you are ready. Tell us in the comments that you're ready to take a stand and love your body and treat it right. Especially what's going on in the world right now. We're wasting all of these precious moments in these bodies that deteriorate every day. Everybody gets older. Everybody's bodies go away and we, we spend every moment of the day not liking them or being ashamed of them. 
Let's stop. Let's love every moment about, let's love every moment of life, every part of our bodies. Our bodies do so much for us. They allow us to move around throughout the day. They help us eat, they help us love, they help us have children and do the jobs that we love and have fun with our loved ones. And all we do is spend the, waste all this time on telling our bodies that they're not good enough. We wouldn't do anything in a day without our body. So from this day forward, I made a pact with my body. I am feeding it right, I'm loving it right, I'm treating it right, and I'm not gonna put it down anymore. I want you guys to come on this journey because it's so important to love ourselves and our bodies and be grateful to them instead of be angry at them. As you may know, I've struggled with my weight my whole life. And before my weight loss journey, I yo-yo dieted. I did every diet you could think of. Like I said in my letter, I, I overfed my body. I underfed my body. I just put it through so much trauma with dieting and with not feeding it, trying to constantly lose weight and make my body something that it's not. Trying to force my body to be something it's not meant to be. And then I discovered portion control and I let myself eat what I wanted in portion and I lost 130 pounds and I've kept it off and I've been trying to treat my body better and feed it what it needs. However, I'm ready for the next step. I'm ready to move to I'm ready to move into intuitive eating and trust my body and give it exactly what it needs. And I know I'm ready for that now. I don't need to diet anymore. I don't need to worry about so much about portions. I'm ready to let my body tell me what it needs and when it needs. It has shown me this entire time, my entire life, that it knows what it needs and it sticks by me and I am ready. I know there's gonna be bumps along the way. I know I'm gonna make mistakes, but my body trusts me and I'm ready to trust my body. So the friends, I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope that you get inspired to really treat your body like someone you love. That's a quote that I heard somewhere recently and I really like that. Treat yourself and your body like someone you love. And that is something I'm ready to do. It's time that we love ourselves and our bodies and stop putting them down. So, thank you so much for watching. Do the stuff! Like the bills, Instagram at the collects, and now we shake it! I <laughs> can't do the frog in that skirt, eh? Nope. <laughs> so we shake it. Hey, I'll take the shake. Till we make it. <laughs> Love yourself, peace, collects out. See you guys. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.